This is a Truth Transforms Truth Nugget. A daily dose of truth for your daily transformation. Welcome back to another Truth Nugget. Today we're going to take a look at Proverbs 21 verse 2. Every way of a man is right in his own eyes, but the Lord weighs the heart. Here we see that man is always looking to rationalize his sin. This is the man that is apart from Christ. He doesn't see his wickedness. He doesn't see his sin. And certainly he does know that there are moral things and immoral things. And he does understand that there are right things that people do and there are wrong things that people do. But ultimately he doesn't see that he is a sinner in need of a savior. Now this also speaks to the Christian as we all deal with our sinful flesh and we all wrestle with the sin that remains. And so we can rationalize sin. We can rationalize things and say, no, we see that as being right. I don't see that as being a problem. And that does occur, but when it is pointed out by the word of God, whether by another brother or sister in Christ, through the preaching of God's word, through our own reading and study of God's word, it is when it is pointed out that we need to confess of that sin, repent of that sin, which means to confess and forsake of it, to confess it to God and to turn from it, and to no longer commit that sin, to no longer deliberately be walking in that sin. And so we need to to, to no longer be rationalizing those actions. That's all absolutely necessary. Every man, every way of a man is right in his own eyes, but the Lord weighs the heart. God is looking at the heart. God is looking at what's happening deep in your heart. The things that you're rationalizing, the things that you might be even uh, deceiving yourself about because we know that the heart is deceitful above all else and desperately wicked, Jeremiah tells us. And so we need to recognize that and we need to constantly be judging our actions and our heart attitudes against God and what he says in his word. And so be prayerfully in his word and constantly allowing us to conform us to his image. So let us continually do that as we walk to know the Lord and grow closer to him more and more each day. Well, I do pray that was a blessing. Please tune back in tomorrow for another Truth Nugget. God bless you and have a good day.